Yo, what's going on guys? I'm Sam and today here with a first look at dark mode in iOS 13. Uh, I don't know about you guys, but I've literally been waiting on this feature since I started my YouTube channel about six and a half years ago. And in the palm of my hand, iOS 13 beta one available right now for developers. If you're watching this and you're like, why isn't it on my phone? It's coming out for everybody in September or the fall of this year. But for now, it's just in a private beta with a public beta to follow soon. So if you're excited for dark mode, if you've been waiting on this too, drop a like down below, show me some love there. And of course hit subscribe. So you stay up to date on all the latest Apple news. Now let's go ahead and take a look at dark mode for the first time ever. So let's head over to control center. This is the easiest way I found to enable it so far. If you have 3D touch, hard press and tap on the display brightness section or long press and hold on other devices. And then in the bottom left hand corner of your screen, the toggle we've been waiting on forever, just tap that once to enable dark mode and there it is. Your iPhone has transformed into dark mode and you'll notice right off the bat if you go back to the home screen and you're using the stock really cool looking iOS 13 wallpaper. By the way, if you're not on iOS 13 yet and you wanna download that, I will leave a link down below for you. Your wallpaper transitions from a light version of the wallpaper to a dark version of the wallpaper. And there are actually four new color variants of this light mode slash dark mode wallpaper, which is really cool. They got orange, blue, green, and another color here. And I have to say they all look pretty cool. I'm always impressed by Apple's wallpaper selection and this year they didn't fail us yet again. And of course that dark refresh goes alongside all of the other stock Apple apps on your device. So head over to mail or calendar or messages or Safari or pretty much anywhere else. And on an iPhone 10 style device, you'll see that true OLED black. So there could actually be, talk about the benefits of dark mode, some battery savings because on an OLED device like the iPhone 10, 10 XS or 10 XS Max, those are the only devices that could get this potential battery savings because of the screen tech inside of them. You might end up seeing better battery life as the individual pixels are literally turned off. I'll have to put that to the test just a little bit later. But as you all can see, no matter where you are in iOS now, as far as Apple's first party apps go, you got dark mode. And I have to say, it looks pretty much just as good as I would have anticipated. The detail on all the apps is pretty incredible, whether the blur being darkened now. I mean, it's clear that Apple didn't just rush something out. They spent a lot of time on this and it definitely shows as you use your iPhone, it feels like every single part of the interface was touched just a little bit by dark mode. Now you might be asking, well, what happens if you have some third party Apple? applications. Well, developers have to update their apps to work with dark mode. It should be a pretty easy process. And a lot of apps actually already have dark modes installed, but they won't change like natively until they're updated sort of through the app store with the new like native dark mode API or class. And of course, dark mode also looks great on the iPad as well. So if you go to the iPad, you can do the same thing, go to control center and enable it through the like display brightness section. Uh, again, like it looks really fresh. It looks really clean. And I'm going to be honest, I'm not a doctor here, but I'm pretty sure this is going to be better for your eyes as well, especially coupled with night shift, which dynamically changes the color temperature of your screen to a warmer color. Uh, and that's been out in iOS for a few years now. So that's nothing new, but all in all guys, I got to hear your thoughts down below. What do you think of dark mode? Is it everything you expected or were you looking forward to something a little bit different? This is definitely what I wanted to see. And it's now in my hand and my eyes aren't going to hurt every single night ever again. Again. So that's dark mode. Drop a like if you enjoyed this video, hit subscribe for more. And of course, stick around for more great videos on iOS 13 coming very soon. I've been Sam. Hope all of you are doing well and I'll see you all in my next video.